Oh, God, so tiring. So many assignments and laboratories. What am I supposed to do again? God, I completely forgot it. I gotta do that. Okay, am I ready for gold saucer? We ain't gonna save you if you get heat. Is this super big one really? What are you looking at? Alright, well, let's do this. There's really nothing much I can do. I finished all the side quests. Ready? Then let's get a move on. This will take us all the way to the salsa. Hey, you can't let those assholes talk to you like that. We should go back and beat them up or something. Practically, the whole damn town came out to crap on him. Someone tell me why I'm the only one who's pissed here. <sighs> I told you, I can take it. Think you could at least tell us what it was all about? They were talking like you sold them out for money, but I know that isn't true. That's not you. So how'd they get it so wrong? Where the hell is it? This about her? About Marlene? <sighs> Corral wasn't much. Decent place with decent coal. Decent folks, too. Rough around the edges, but big hearts. Salt of the earth. And I sold them all down the river. Took away their future and their hope. We were happy. Covered in soot and porous dirt. But none of that mattered. We had friends and family, and that was enough. Till we learned about the miracle of Mako and all we'd been missing out on. And then we just had to have a taste. <laughs> so now only Dine is opposed. Damn right I am. We can't just abandon the mines. Not after our fathers and grandfathers risked their lives to maintain them. I hear you, Dan. I do. But nobody sees any future in coal. So I ask you, why break our backs working harder and harder when we're taking home less year after year? Mm. <sighs> if I may, sir. Once the reactor is complete, a portion of the revenue will go to the town. Your community will be preserved, or enriched, I should say. Listen, man. 
This is your chance to give your daughter a better life than what we have. You think I haven't thought about that? Come on. Are we gonna let some city slickers tell us our coal is worthless? We gonna let them tell us we're worthless? It would seem we've reached an impasse. In which case, any further discussion would be a waste of breath. So, Mr. Mayor, shall we put it to a vote? Static. Convinced it was the dawn of a new era. Then one day... <clears throat> the reactor exploded. Y'all saw the aftermath. Saucer's waiting. sympathy or your pity. You can keep all of that nonsense. I did what I did, and I can live with it. Right. We gotta shake this off. We're about to rock up to the funnest place ever. The Gold Saucer! Huh? So turn those frowns upside down. <laughs> what in the hell? Ain't no one but you thinking about how much fun we're gonna have. Right. Want to have a look? It's coming up over there. Uh. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Glad to see we're all on the same page. And 
hello to you too. <gasps> this is incredible. What is that? Is that supposed to be a summon? Oh, we're in Vegas now. Come on, come on. From Hawaii to Vegas. Shall we? Let's. <laughs> Why are you guys here? Clear icicles. Why did we arrive in this uh, straight to a staff room? I guess where we entered is not your typical entrance. And no one really goes to go around to go to go the gold saucer, I guess. Yeah, oh yeah yeah yeah. Those helicopters I see, I see, yeah. Those helicopters drop off people from Costa del Sol straight to go the gold saucer. Seller and Hojo's lab rat. Who are these people? At least they're finally on a real wanted list. It's about time. That's all well and good, but why am I in charge of handing out the posters? Don't they know I have a division to run? I think you're where the president wants you. Others are waiting. Gold saucer. Never ending fireworks. Anything to say? The Gold Saucer. Chocoba Square, Event Square, Battle Square, Ghost Square, Wonderman, Skywheel, Speed. parking this is our desert parking area access is reserved for guests with vehicles and their companions this is our desert parking area 
Access is reserved for guests with vehicles oh, that tank. their companions. Oh yeah, this is where I'm gonna be meeting Kate. Oh god, Kate. That's such a challenge, we must rise to meet it. Are you ready to rumble? What's gonna happen? You can do this, Cloud. Huh? What's happening? A dance up again? <laughs> Second 
seconds out. And bang! Ha ha ha! Practice, eh? How prudent! <laughs> Come on! Wait, what? A right hook, left hook. Oh, so you cannot just keep spamming. Give our worthy contender another thunderous round of applause! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what you always like, uh, being cool. about ever since he was a kid being cool well thanks <laughs> nice punching up there cloud <laughs> a small token of my thanks <sighs> one golden ticket your ticket to paradise <laughs> cool <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Cloud's used to performing in front of crowds. You should have seen him at the Honey Bee Inn. Aerith. Oh, you've got to tell me that one later. <laughs> I can't. Uh. No, not yet. I want to see everyone. A thunder. Stamp balloons, chocobo mascot, Never be enough, Barrett. Let's put it to a vote then. Teensy little prick! All those in favor! Huh? Me! Me! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Barrett, loosen up. Not yet, Barrett. Wait your turn. You can just wait there. Oh, come on, let me explore a, li a little bit. God, I'm stuck. What the hell is wrong with those guys? 
won't last. What? Mako, when it's gone, so is this. Where'd that come from? Paraphrasing you. Well, you're not wrong. But I get your point. Live it up while you can. You just not promised to no one. When will our amusement park be something like this, like holographic and stuff like that? Gives the atmosphere as well. Gargoyles. It's the haunted mansion. here a man with a rain cloud over his head so how about a reading to clear those somber skies whether it be dark or bright i'll read your future right just didn't go shooting the messenger eh? this some kind of toy Yoo lads eyes up here <laughs> hey, kate sith fortune teller extraordinaire put it there It's a toy, all right. Pretty lifelike, though. Come on, pal. Give us a smile. The gold saucer's meant to be a happy place filled with happy people, don't you know? So show us those pearly whites. Back off. You coming? Sorry about that, Kate. We got the grumpy old dude here. Someone's got a bee in their bonnet. Strange. Most folks like me. Someone's got a bee in their bonnet. Tacky. 
seems classy now. I get to play Queen's Blood with ghosts. Violin. What is that thing? So the hotel is four stories? The material shop. Very robot. So I want to tell you the story. One evening, right around midnight, he hears a sound outside his room. So he gets up, goes over to the door, and looks through the people. Sees a new Tonberry robot. That is dripping with blood. As he shuffles down the hallway, real slow, till he is out of sight. For the jerk who smashed it up. Night after night, that Tarnberry stalks the hotel halls seeking revenge. And if it crosses paths with ill mannered guests, that will leave it of the one who did it wrong. Stab right through their heart. A robot with a grudge. Scary stuff. Goblin. So a friend told me the story. One evening, right around midnight, he hears a sound outside his room. So the room service here is the next level. Right to the doorstep. Tells me I'm going to have the worst nightmares when I go to bed. I'm getting this tingling up and down my spine. Wait, maybe I've got some kind of sixth sense. Oh, God, sleepy. There's an elevator service here. You won't believe this, but I finally got the Marlboro room. I've heard it's to die for. I can't wait to spend an entire night surrounded by Marlboro everything. Now that's the stuff of dreams. I'm in the Mandragora room myself. There's no better way to start your day at the Gold Saucer than to be woken by the sound of screams. Now that I've managed to book the Marlboro suite, which should I try next? Decisions, decisions. I'd like to stay in the behemoth. But alas, that one's reserved for families only. Oh, I know. Why don't we book it together? Half the cost, double the fun. Are you sure? That would be perfect. One night in the behemoth room is all I need to complete my suite. 
Oh, those are weird. Picture of the coral lines, huh? Oh god. Hmm. Tacky and understaffed. Great. Hello? <laughs> Welcome, gentle sirs. What in the hell was that? <laughs> My most sincere apologies. <sighs> Got any rooms? There's six of us all told. Well, five and one pet. Hmm. Might I inquire as to what kind of pet? Uh... He was joking. Make it six. Very well. Now then. Hmm. Oh. I'm terribly sorry, gentlemen, but it appears we're all booked up for the night. <sighs> for crying out loud. What about the other hotels? Forgive me, sir. But according to my records, all of our hotels are sadly fully booked. What? <gasps> Hello again. Nowhere to stay? And what's it to you? Now then, did you want one sweet or two? <sighs> You trying to scam us? I wouldn't even dream of such a thing. And to prove it, I'll foot the entire bill myself. Sure you will. Well, aren't we a prickly bunch? You there, dangly man. Would you mind checking one more time? Hmm? Timely cancellation. <laughs> the Tonberry and Eligor suites have just become available. Shall I book them for you? Eligor suites. <laughs> it feels so good to do good. All right, lads, enjoy your stay. <laughs> to the loo. What about those guys who's booked for your those suites? Places? Are on the fourth floor. Please proceed to the elevator at the top of the stairs. Hey, your blood's gonna go to your head, man. <laughs> I hope your chambers are to your liking. Once you check in here, there's no backing out. <laughs> I hope your chambers are to your liking. There you are. The offer still stands. A fortune or two to steer you through. You can answer any question. Of course. Be it this, be it that, go on and ask the cat. Okay, we're looking for Sephiroth. Think you can find him? Oh, Sephiroth, you see. All right, hold on to your underpants. Meow, 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 meow. Things are looking up. So throw caution to the wind. Put your trust in others, and a last-minute twist may pleasantly surprise you. What's this got to do with Sephiroth? What, indeed? Give me another chance. I'll get it this time. Come on! Watch your belongings. Lucky color. Black? Yeah. We're done. 
Wait, don't go. Third time's a charm. Come on, you stupid thing. Anything the matter? <laughs> Seek and you are sure to find. But alas, you shall forever lose what you cherish most. <laughs> the stars work in mysterious ways. <laughs> you good? Yeah, it's just what I cherish most. Uh, see what this crap does. My apologies, sir. Yeah, I wonder what this My readings are normally bang on. Stars mustn't be smiling on me. Odd. My readings are normally bang on. Huh. What is it about? Is it aired? I don't think so. If it's more important to uh, cloud than air it. Uh, memories? Memories. Yeah, probably. Memories. Yeah, because at the end of the remake, he ended up having his power back in Advent Children. Like cutting trains and whatnot. And when they defeated the Whispers, as what Aerith said, it kind of deleted all their memories. But it's already deleted though, so... Huh! So probably aired it then. You wish to go down, I presume? I'm up, please. Fourth floor. Of course. Very well. Fourth floor it is. What was that bang sound? Goodness me! Under the name Palmer, director of space and aeronautics. <laughs> yes, of course. Oh, one moment, please. <laughs> it says here you canceled those rooms. What? No, we didn't. <sighs> While we did have you booked for the Tonberry and Elagor suites. Mr. Palmer sent word that they were no longer required. That's impossible. Uh, is something wrong? We lost the rooms. What? Tell him who I am. I did. Oh. Well, no point dwelling on it. Now, where can a man get a drink around here? <laughs> oh. Waitress? You just go with the flow, huh? You have yourselves a ghoulish, morbid evening. Back. I think the same man. Right, you can actually see Elena in Reno from up here. Yeah. <laughs> 
starting this Johnny Seaside flea trap. I'm gonna head out for a bit. Cool. But not for fun, just to take a walk. Hey, you've been acting pretty weird lately, Cloud. Rest up and shake it off. You hear me? Yeah. I hear you. Alone with the Thornberry. So, isn't it something? A white box? What is that? Oh god. Did do anything? Wow. Amazing room. So if you did put back the book, will this change? No. If you stand here, does it do anything? Turn where can you actually go there? What if this worm movie got her What? Stay there. The heck? Stay there. Is it gonna move? Is it gonna move? Ugh. I 
What's gonna happen if you sleep here? thought. Take off your shoes, Cleo. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. Oh, I'm actually controlling Zeg, I thought... Uh... Huh, never seen material like this before. Something about the color... Didn't peg you as a bookworm. Wait, I can, so you can actually move? Well, this has become very interesting all of a sudden. Cloud and... Are, are you really gonna be like that? Before you inherit Zaxwell? <laughs> 